Who's that wasn't at me, right? My new thing for today is going to be trying exotic fruits. So I'm gonna go to my local grocery store and see what kind of weird fruits that they have there. I think they have weird fruits year round. I hope because that's my thing for today. expected 30 bucks on fruit so let's get home and eat this i am back and ready to get started on trying the fruit let's start with the papaya i don't know if there's like a specific way you're supposed to cut these or not how to cut a papaya apparently i need a couple of more things we have our bowl and our vegetable peeler cut each end off whoa look at that that's kind of weird looking inside. This side. <laughs> oh, these seeds are so weird. They kind of look like fish eggs or something. So it just reminds me of the inside of like a pumpkin when you're like carving the guts and seeds out. Got all of the seeds out. Either this vegetable peeler is not good or I just don't know what I'm doing. Corner done. So we're just gonna... See how there's like this little hard looking part? I don't know if I'm supposed to eat that lighter part. And I feel like with a lot of fruits, you're not supposed to eat that harder part. I don't know how I feel about that. I feel like if I were to eat a flower, this is what a flower would taste like. Dull sweet and like a fragrant sweet. I don't know if that makes any sense. I think I would give that like a 6.5 out of 10 on flavor. Papaya is not my favorite, but it's not very bad. It's not like raspberries. I hate raspberries. I think I'm going to try... The star fruit next. How to cut a star fruit. Star fruit. Very common. This guy is so cute that's today. cutting it. I thought that was going to be a lot more complicated. <laughs> it's cute little stars. Look at the cute little stars. Like I know it's called star fruit, but like seeing it like that, this is so cute. I like don't understand the flavor. This tastes like if like a pear and an apple had a baby, but it had like a little bit of tanginess to it too. Whoa. That last bite was a little bit more sour. I'd probably rate that like a seven and a half out of 10. Go ahead and put that in there. All right. On to, look at this pokey little guy. I don't know what he is. Hold on. So apparently this little thing is called a horned melon. Um, it also goes by African horned cucumber, spiked melon, jelly melon, kiwano, or cucosaurus. No idea what to expect from this. It just looked cool, so I bought it. This thing is actually so spiky. Like, every time I touch it, it just pokes me. Look at the inside of it. This is so weird. A kiwi and a cucumber had a baby and then it went into like a kaleidoscope. You can't tell me that's not what that looks like. Then the outside is like a freaking orange and a Pokemon had a baby. This is such a cool looking fruit. It smells like, kind of like cucumber though. Like it does not smell fruity. Oh, this is so weird. <gasps> Whoa, wait. Every little seed is in like a little pod, kind of like pomegranate seeds. I don't like this. Looking at this, you would think it would taste fruity. It's like tangy cucumber. I'm not a big fan of that. I like, I want, I keep eating it because I want to like it. Dang. I was hoping this one would taste like super crazy delicious. Okay, so it goes by both like pomelo and like pomelo. Oh shoot. This says it's an ancestor of the grapefruit. I hate grapefruits. Grapefruit tastes like my throw up. This thing is huge. This is hard to cut. It kind of smells like, like there's like a flower that it kind of smells like. So after you cut into it a little bit, you just peel it off. I wonder why these have such like a thick, like shell or whatever to them. Cause you look at like 
oranges or lemons or limes like other citrus fruits and they have very thin outer layers and this one's like thick so I'm supposed to just cut off the white stuff I'm just gonna tear it apart oh I'm so strong look I got like a little segment out kind of like in the clementine but it's like huge all right let's go for it mmm mmm Mmm, that was weird. Like, the initial flavor was like, ooh, yum. But then, like, after a couple seconds, it's like, ooh, it tastes, it has a hint of, like, almost grapefruity. So I'll say it starts at an 8 out of 10, then goes down to a 6 out of 10 with the aftertaste. It's kind of fun to eat, though. I feel like this kind of looks like lungs. I mean, I've never seen actual lungs before, but, like, doesn't that kind of look like what you see in, like, the diagrams of lungs? My least favorite, definitely the horned melon just no 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 papaya probably comes in third place not bad not as bad as the horn melon but not as good as the other ones probably put the pomelo in second place i don't have a place to hold it and then star fruit is probably my favorite out of those none of these are going to be my favorite fruits like in general like these can't compare to like kiwis or like strawberries to me to be honest those are so much better but they weren't bad, besides the horned melon. That was not fruity. That literally tastes like a freaking tangy cucumber. Like, no. Thanks for watching. If you want to join in on my Something New 22 challenge, go ahead and use the hashtag SomethingNew22 on any of the content that you make, and I will see you in tomorrow's episode.